Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by, and of course, you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another edition of Friday's Finds. We're going to call this one On the Water. This is the On the Water edition of Friday's Finds. And that big box right there is the reason we're calling it that. So I had some conversation with a company. It's Tuck Tick. Tuck Tick. The Tuck Tick Company. They're a U.S. They're, they're an American company. Made in America. And they make the coolest thing. I'm so excited. I wish I'd have had this last week. Of course, you may not see those videos until after this video. And when you're watching those videos, you're going you're gonna to say, well, anyway. I was wishing I had this, but it arrived after I left. So anyway, enough rambling. Let's open the box. Come on, dude. Get that box open. Well, that was hard, wasn't it? <laughs> there it is. There it is, right there. How about that? That was, that was hard. Okay. I got some papers I gotta read. Shouldn't take too very long. I'm not, I'm not even gonna, you already know what it is. It's a folding kayak. This is, this is actually a, a, a roll up, fold up kayak. I'm gonna read the instructions and then we're gonna put it together. And then we'll talk about the other two products. We have three products. We have three things to talk about on the, on the, in the, on the water, in the, on the water, in this edition, in this on the water edition of Friday's Fine. I read the book, four pages. I watched the video. A little bit, it's, it's kind of cool, and they recommend doing this on a warm day, above 70 degrees, and we're in the 60s. But there's some sunshine, so I'm going to put it in the sun and let it warm up, and then come out, well, as much sun as we have. We don't have a whole lot of sun. We're going to put it out here and let it warm up. while we're waiting on the sun to do its part. We're gonna have a kayak. We gotta be able to make that kayak move. And I didn't know this, but you need to buy your kayak. You need to get kayak paddles based on your height. I didn't know it, but it makes sense. That's where I did a little research. And I found, what did I find? I found the Ocean Broad. The Ocean Broad kayak. This is for people my height. I'm six foot two. It comes with a, a strap. And it's green. It's about as close as green as I could get. The Tuck Tech Company offers a really great warranty 
It only took like two days, three days for it to get. They're made in Georgia. Made and shipped out of Georgia. It didn't take very long for it to get here. But it was just a little late. So we have adjustable angles so that you can get the most out of your kayak experience. Water doesn't drip down on you. All right. Now if we're gonna be on the water, any water, we need to be safe. And this is not a new thing. This I've been using this for quite some time. Most people don't like wearing life jackets. But my life jacket, I hardly ever know I've got it on. This is the Eisen, Eason, E-Y-S-A-N, S-A-N, Eason. The Eason self-inflating life vest. If you fall in the water, it automatically inflates. It has a CO2 cartridge. And if you you're not if that doesn't work, then you've got a a button, a lanyard you can pull right here. And it inflates. Very comfortable to wear. And you hardly even know it's there. It's not one of those big bulky things. I like it. Now all of these items are found on Amazon. And there will be a link in the description and in the card above. Meanwhile, we're waiting on the sun to warm that thing up so we can put it together. Uh, and we've got some thunderstorms in the forecast and the wind is blowing pretty hard, but if, if the opportunity presents itself, I'm gonna put this thing in the water on this video. Now, this is not really an assembly video. I've got it assembled. Leaving it out in the sun for a little bit allowed it to warm up and made it a little more pliable. Still kind of stiff. Very simple design. There's there's six latches that hold the, the whole assembly together. You've got a seat. And they've got a really great instructional. They're having a great instructional video on the tucktech.com website. Tucktech.com slash 2023. Have cargo straps on the front. Seems like, like, like that might create a little drag. But you know, this is not a performance kayak. It does have a skeg, which is gonna help it to track. And that skeg is retractable. You actually have a little rope you can pull here that'll raise the skeg. I think the seat is gonna need a little more cushion. Back seems kind of low, but it weighs 28 pounds. So it weighs less than 30 pounds. It folds up pretty flat, flat enough as a matter of fact that it will fit into one of those small pass-through compartments that between in the RV. So I've got these spaces you know, a lawn chair will fit, but you can't put much else in there. The Tuk Tuk kayak will. I'm excited. Very excited. Now, Tuk Tuk did send this to me for marketing purposes. So I'll be putting it in the water. Yeah, in this video. I got to find some water there. It's not real windy. Because it'll be my first time. And I don't want to do... I don't, I don't want to be in a whitewater situation for the first time. So I'm going to break it down and figure out where we're going to go and get in the, put it on the water. Second time I assembled it, it took me less than 10 minutes, probably closer to five. I didn't time it. So we're going to get out on the water. See how it floats. Not too shabby for a fold up piece of plastic.
tracks really well. I actually strapped this onto the rack of the Valkyrie, the e-bike. I'm a, I'm a little wobbly. Very much hard to turn into the wind. That skeg definitely keeps you going straight. I feel like my, my paddle needs to be a little longer, but that may just be me and my lack of experience in a kayak.
the tuck tech. I'm really a pro I've done a lot of these product videos over the last what year, year and a half. Well, since I started the channel, well, that's that adds up. I have 800 product videos on Amazon. The Tuck Tech folding kayak is like right up there in my top five favorite things I've ever got to play with. That's a heck of a thing. I've looked at the other origami folding canoes and kayaks that are on the market. Most of them, all of them have a higher price point than that and seem to be a little more involved. Now, the first time I put it together, took me took me a minute or two the second time it, it took me a minute or two to figure it out even after watching the video the second time i popped that bad boy together in, in less than five minutes and was ready to get in the water that's impressive it weighs less than 30 pounds i strapped it on the back of the e-bike <laughs> it's amazing what can i say now the, the paddle i'm not sure if about that i don't know if that's me or if it's the paddle there's definitely uh some some more learning that's the first time i've ever really been in a kayak been in some canoes not kayaks i'm really impressed i was kind of unstable but that's me i'm very unstable anyway uh not not mental take that away don't say that just the the physical thing I, I i'm not a real stable my chassis out of line <laughs> yeah that's what that's a good way to say it my, my chassis is a little out of line that thing rocks all right i'm gonna quit i'm gonna quit raving i'm gonna quit ranting if this is your first visit to the dude rv channel i sure appreciate you stopping by and if you enjoyed it please click on that thumbs up blast me out across your social media if you've not already i'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button and for those of you who have been following along thank you i, I i'm honored that you invite me into your space and for my patrons i'm so grateful you guys rock all right y'all come back now you hear